Hey guys, I am back. So I cut all my papers. Hopefully you get to see that process. I have a new um, video editor. I had to do a hard reset on my computer. There were some issues going on with it. And unfortunately I lost my old editing um, software and they don't have it anymore. Just my luck. Um, so I have some new editing equipment. So hopefully you get to see that process. If not, I will show you. I cut down all my papers to 4 by 6 and then I have a good chunk of 2 by 6 and 2 and a half by 6 as well. Um, I pretty much pulled my Christmas paper that I showed before. Um, I also went ahead and pulled some other papers. I pulled some from Bell Bunny. I used the greens and the foliage and possibly did I use the grays? I can't even remember. Some of the blacks maybe. But I used that. And then um, I also pulled this wild asparagus for the pinks and some of the greens. I kind of wanted to go pink and teal with the green, red, and black as well. And I also pulled this lily and moss. And on the back of lily and moss, I have some punch out little die cuts. And I try to use what I, th I pull, up, pull what I could use. There we go. And that is this little stash right here. Most of the little um, phrases and stuff were happy birthday, thank you related, that would not work, but I found a couple that would. I went ahead and cut all my labels and punched them out. Um, I did also get my punches some use. I punched some of the Christmas paper here. I got some punches. And I went to Joann's and picked up two pieces of paper. They have 50% off. And the first one was a whole sheet of these cute little squares. Um, these Christmas little squares. So I, I got those all cut up. And the other sheet was, I want to say Maggie Holmes Christmas. I can't even remember. I should know this line. I love this line. I should know crepe paper. And I cannot remember the name of it, but it brings more of the pinks and the teals. And so I'm excited about that. And um, all in all, I am ready for December Daily, guys. Thank you for watching.